Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Dave Bryan. On Thursday, our very own Alex Kazora released his short list of draft hopeful players that the Pittsburgh Steelers are likely to choose from this year when it comes to their first round selection. That list was not just haphazardly thrown together either, as it is built around the pro days that Steelers general manager Kevin Colbert attended this year, in addition to the team's drafting history as well. In short, it's a very good bet that this year's Steelers first round selection will come from that short list that Alex put together. Interesting enough, Alex's short list does not include any offensive linemen, and that's quite interesting. No offensive linemen on that list obviously means no tackles either. So, if you're holding out hope that the Steelers will draft a tackle in the first round this year, you are very likely to be disappointed once again. I say once again because the Steelers haven't drafted a tackle in the first round since 1996 when Jermaine Stevens was selected 29th overall out of North Carolina A&T. Basically, and the point I am attempting to make, is that the Steelers have not selected a tackle in the first round of any draft since Colbert arrived in Pittsburgh in 2000. That's quite a run for the Steelers, and according to my research, they are the only one of the 32 NFL franchises to boast that claim dating back to 2000. So, why hasn't Colbert ever drafted a tackle in the first round? I just think it's one of those funny coincidences and most likely tied to the fact that the Steelers haven't selected in the top 16 picks much since Colbert arrived in 2000. The better tackles every year generally come off the board in the first round ahead of pick number 17. Only six times since 2000 had the Steelers made a first round selection in the first 16 picks of any draft and two of those occasions they traded up into those spots to do so. One other time was in 2004 when the team selected quarterback Ben Roethlisberger 11th overall. One other time was in 2000, Colbert's first year with the Steelers, when the team selected wide receiver Plaxico Burris 8th overall. 25 years of not selecting a tackle in the first round is quite a run and one would think that streak would come to an end sooner rather than later. Will it end in 2023? We'll see. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with myself and Alex Kazora every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.